Hello, this is Leonardo, and this is a follow-up of my video on the Borg filter. And as you may already have seen, the Borg has a switch that allows you to change it between the low pass and high pass mode. And uh, a common architecture for Borg is to have two of them in series. So I just wanted to make a well, rather than showing you how the high pass and low pass sound, I'm just gonna make a patch, and uh, it's a very simple to show up some some of the sounds. And just to make it sound good, I'm gonna add a river plateau in this case uh, because. A reverb makes everything sound good. So let's listen to it. Just a little bit of reverb, not that much. Okay, so one interesting thing with the high pass filter is that you can use it to, to remove the, the bottom end of your signal. Like this, having only highs. But you can also use it to enhance um, parts of the of the bottom end, for example, uh, by using the resonance. So let's take a listen. So he, here we are bumping a bit, a little bit the the low, and you can select where. And of course, if you increase the resonance a lot, you're gonna it's, it's gonna self oscillate. And then we just use the the low pass to cut part of of the top end. One trick that is quite nice is uh, that you can use uh, an oscillator and do FM with with the Borg, for example. And I'm gonna take another blick and I'm gonna use something that resembles a triangle wave, which is this part of the wave. And I'm gonna connect that signal directly to the cutoff control of work. Let's do the same with the second filter and see how it sounds.
So that's it. This is me playing with two works and one reverb. Uh, I hope you like it. Uh, well, if you're into these kind of things, you may like it because I like it a lot. I like uh, these kind of strange sounds. And as simple as this. Thanks for watching and subscribe to this channel to get more updates on the Vault modules and also other stuff that I'm that I'm gonna be doing during these days. So goodbye. Thank you.